If you have the ability to stop time, will you use it to undress girls like Willis does? The movie's name is Cashback. Willis is a senior in an art college. His girlfriend Susie wants to break up with him. Willis doesn't understand the reason he develops insomnia after a painful breakup with his girlfriend. Every day he is in constant pain, not knowing how to get through this. He applies for night shift staff at the supermarket. He says he always has been impressed by the beauty of the female body. So besides work, he also likes to see female customers. But every time he's interrupted by the bald boss, the night shift work is always monotonous and boring. Sharon never notices the time. She feels that the more she watches the clock, the slower time goes by. Matt and Barry know how to ride a sled, but often crashes. To escape the boredom inherent in the night shift he imagines that he can stop time, so that he can walk around in a world that is frozen like the pause of a film. Finally the ability to stop time becomes real. He takes advantage of stopping time to undress female customers. Think that he's going to do something bad, but he takes out the paper and starts drawing their bodies. This sensitive image doesn't embarrass others at all. On the contrary, there is also a sense of solemnity of art. After he's done, he helps them to redress neatly. Then he cracks his fingers and makes everything back to normal. During this special time, he finds a new happiness and joy. Sharon is very cute and pretty, attracting Willis's attention. He gradually loves her. Although he doesn't directly express his love to Sharon, he uses his ability to stop time to draw all of Sharon's poses. He paints her only. Her frown or smile both fascinates him. One day Willis can't hold it any longer, immediately confesses his love to Sharon. He receives a sweet kiss from Sharon. Thanks to the kiss, his magic spell is destroyed he's able to sleep well. The next day he wakes up he gets a call. Someone says that he has seen all of Willis's paintings and hopes to help him organize an art gallery. He's overjoyed to have a party at home to celebrate. Ex-girlfriend Susie also arrives. Susie asks Willis why he wants to reunite with her a few days ago, but now he has a beautiful new girlfriend. Susie kisses him right there and asks to reunite. Just as Sharon witnesses from afar, Sharon angrily leaves the party. Ben realizes Sharon has seen the kiss and freezes time. He is quietly with Sharon for two days and two nights, still unable to figure out how to explain and what to do to make up for Sharon's hurt. Ben concludes that, although he can stop time, he cannot reverse it to correct the mistake. Time go on and Sharon walks away in anger. He eventually seeks to explain himself to Sharon at her apartment, and a confrontation occurs. Being heartbroken again discourages him. He puts all his hopes on the gallery, but he doesn't know that this is just a joke by Matt and Barry. The owner of the gallery says he has never made contact with Willis, leaving him extremely confused. But he still wants to see Willis's work. Surprisingly, he is nonetheless interested in Ben's work and decides to exhibit Ben's drawings. The exhibition is a great success, receiving a lot of recognition from art artists. Sharon receives an invitation to the exhibition and visits. She is moved as most of the pieces depict her. This has explained to all. Sharon forgives Willis. He stops the time he takes Sharon to a more romantic place. The two step outside into a time-frozen snowfall. They exchange a passionate kiss. When we fall in love with someone we all want time to cease, so that not every happy moment is recorded in our hearts. If you have the power to stop time, what will you do? This review is over. See you in the following videos. Thank you.